We're here with Emily Batty from Trek Factory Racing. Conclusion of Canada Cup on what is essentially your home course at, at Hardwood where you have won. Does this give you a little bit of deja vu after winning on the, the, the same finish line last year? Yeah, I, I'd say it's 90% of the same track as the Pan Am uh, course. Um, and I was here on Wednesday for the Wednesday night race and did a few laps. And um, so yeah, it's always fun to be back at Hardwood. And uh, you know, I know this track really well and it's just a great uh, training race between um, La Bresse and, uh, and World Championships in, a, in two weeks time. Yeah, so this will, I'm assuming, be your, your final race before World. So how, how are you feeling about your form after your ride here? Yeah, pretty good where, and, and where I want to be. Um, you know, World Championships and Rio's start line relies on the UCI points. Um, so last week's Canada Cup and this week, um, there there are a few points that I was trying to accumulate, which is great. And um, like you said, like it's a great training race. And um, yeah, I mean, all in all, I was just, you know, feeling good. And um, just, and, and riding with the guys is always fun because they're just as aggressive as the girls um, in the top 10. So. Uh, it's a great learning experience that I'll always take advantage of. Now, as you said, as you said, about two weeks to uh, Mountain Bike Worlds. So, what's your schedule look like for the next next couple of weeks leading up to the Worlds? Um, so, I'm home now. Um, uh, my team, we're doing a uh, another two episodes of Ambitions. So, uh, you can stay tuned for a couple more episodes to see what I've been doing and what I've been up to. Um, so, look forward to that. And uh, yeah, just you know, focus on training and uh, recovery and. I'm um, just enjoying being home and seeing the people that I don't get to see often enough. Well, again, congratulations and uh, enjoy your time at home before, uh, before you go on the road for a few months. Awesome. Thank you.